Do you wish there was a post scheduling feature inside of school so you could plan out an entire week of posts and not having to be doing it every single day? That daily repetitive task is currently taking your time away from other tasks that really matters like helping your community uh, with more creative tasks and a bit more impactful work. Well, you're not alone in feeling chained to real-time posting. In this video, we are diving into a solution for all of us in the school community. We are tackling that particular issue, the absence of scheduling features within school. Well, imagine preparing one week of posts and every day each one gets posted automatically based on a schedule or without you being involved. Sounds great, right? If you are in the school community, you've probably seen, I know I have, a lot of community owners have been requesting that feature to schedule posts. And what I've also seen is that Sam Ovens and his team are not planning to implement it anytime soon. The reasoning for that, they don't want bots or they believe that real-time posting creates a more organic and trustworthy feel, which is understandable. But I also understand that scheduling is very important, especially for us solo entrepreneurs in the online space. We can't afford the luxury to, of having a VA and scheduling posts in school is more than a necessity, especially if we want to make sure that we are staying focused on all the other tasks and helping our people out. So that being said, uh, here is the tool that handled the task for me, uh, and it's called Axiom.ai. It's a no-code browser automation tool that, according to the website, saves time using browser bots to automate website actions and repetitive tasks on any website or web app. Scraping data from websites or data entry, any process you need to run inside a browser, you can automate that with action, axiom.ai. So here is how it can automate that particular task, scheduling posts inside school communities. And it starts with a spreadsheet that will contain all the data of each post the title, the text, which categories it's going to go into, the video links. And Axiom will read the first entry from that spreadsheet and use the content in there to post inside your own community. This process can be triggered on a schedule. For instance, every day, I like to post every day inside my community. And the only thing that I need to focus on is actually creating the content on my own time, on my own schedule, without being tied to clicking that post button. And then I just insert it inside the spreadsheet and the automation takes care of the rest for me. I can plan one week of post and I don't have to do that manual intervention. But I could plan out also one month if I want to or even more. What this means for you is no more being tied down, no more frantic last minute posting, just your community thriving with fresh content, appearing like clockwork, all while you focus on what truly matters. Now let's have a look and see it in action. So here on the left side of the screen, right here, you can see the spreadsheet that is used by the automation to take the data and post it inside school as a post inside the community. On the right side, this is just my school community. And what you can see is the spreadsheet has multiple columns. And first one is the title. This is gonna be the headline of the post. Then there's the message. Here's what the message looks like. Then you can select the categories. It's a drop down. You have to put the name of the categories for your personal uh, school community. And then you have the option with a checkbox to send an email to all members, like to notify them. Uh, it's gonna be, um, if we go right here, it's gonna be if you select that to send the email uh, to all members. And you can also add a video link, which is gonna add from uh, right here. So, Let's go ahead with the demonstration. So here is the spreadsheet, here's the school community. I'm gonna just, for the purpose of this example, I'm just gonna click the button to run the automation. This is Axiom. Uh, this is a, an extension for the Chrome browser. So it goes in here. This is the automation itself, and I'm gonna click run. But we can also schedule it from right here or even connect Zapier if we want to. Uh, which is another automation tool that allows to do some scheduling or to run after some specific processes are run. So, but for the sake of this example, I'm just gonna click that button, which just as I said, 
that process can be just automated in the background and run on a schedule. So let's go ahead, click run, run in the cloud. This is to demonstrate that it's going to happen without me being there. And this is going to show what's happening in the background. So you see how it's opening the browser, it's logging in inside my community, and then it's going to open the post and post everything for me. Maybe I'm going to speed the timeline up just for the sake because it, there are some pauses inside the automation. It takes a bit of time to run, but it's it's going to be there and it's going to appear inside the community. So what I can do is I can move that tab right here. I can shut that. We can see the automation happening. And, and it's going to be posting for me. And now that automation is going to be done. The bot is going to close. See, Axiom Run is complete. I can close that window. Let's go back. These are the posts. You can see it's not there, but if I just refresh, he just appeared right here. How would you like? And as you see on the left side, uh, it just automatically deleted the row from the sheet, the first one, and now on to the next. If I add another one, then the next time that automation would run, that next one would be taken and posted. And it goes like this as the automation goes on. So here is how the automation runs and work. Now Axiom.ai just uses data from a spreadsheet as input for his automation, but we can take that a bit further if we want to with another automation that would automatically write inside that spreadsheet for the content if we were to want to generate content from someplace else. Now let's talk about what happens when you bring automation into the mix especially with something as important as scheduling your school posts. In my opinion, automation doesn't replace the personal touch, but it amplifies it. Because ensuring your presence in the community, even when you're focusing on something else somewhere else, it allows you to release valuable content and well thought out content on a daily basis. And you can still come up with those spontaneous posts uh, that you can just post manually and it's going to create an even more engaging community. Also, when your post hit the community at the right time, when your members are the most active, the engagement will naturally increase. Like if you know your audience is more active in the evening, just schedule those daily posts to go out in the evening and you can be with your family at the time. So because you won't have to be there to click that post button. And consistency, that's the backbone of any thriving community. With automation, your content strategy just rolls out smoothly, uh, building trust and anticipation among your members. No more gaps or erratic posting schedules. Scheduling posts inside school communities is just a glimpse of what Axiom.ai can do or automation in general can do. So if this is an automation you are interested in, you are a school community owner and you need to be able to schedule posts and you realize that this is not a feature that's coming out anytime soon, then what I'm doing is I've started a membership program inside my school community. It's called the Smart Automation Lab and it will be teaching you how to do all these automations and more to make your school experience a lot smoother. Every month I'm teaching you new stuff about automations to make your business run smoother and allow you to have more free time to do what's most important, whether it's working more on your business or taking time for the personal activities or even spending time with your family. If you are interested in learning more about my program, you can find all the details inside my school community. You can join it right now, it's opened, and you can also get involved by just asking any questions you might uh, have in there. And the link to the community is just below in the description of this video, and I hope to see you there shortly.